On Saturday, thousands of people will be here at Mahoney State Park taking action together against type 1 diabetes. And so it felt like a natural place to be for Positively the Heartland to talk about what a name change means for the future. JDRF, the R or research part of that bit, but those first two letters no longer did. We haven't called type 1 diabetes juvenile diabetes in many, many years. And it really is a misnomer because 50% of new diagnoses are adults. And even kiddos who are diagnosed with type 1 diabetes grow up to be adults with type 1. People like Chris Dunn's children, Nolan and Patsy, and others like Jared Wills. I was uh, 11 years old when I was diagnosed, so I've had type 1 diabetes for 31 years now. A breakthrough T1D outreach ambassador. He's also a father whose daughter has type 1. We talked about advances made in between his diagnosis and hers. It's life changing. I mean, it truly is. Uh, I was on insulin pumps through college back in the early 2000s. Technology was awesome, but it just doesn't even compare to today. Developments go beyond devices. Take t the first ever disease-modifying drug proven to delay the onset. That's key in the path to prevention. On the cures front, what I'm most excited about, the holy grail for me as a mom, is cell replacement therapy. A transplant, insulin producing beta cells from a cadaver. Breakthrough T1D funded research, which led to a renewable cell source, and those trials are happening today. This research is amazing, but it is very, very expensive, so we have to keep our foot on the gas. Adding sneakers to their feet is one way how. Events like the Breakthrough T1D Walk help raise the money for research and advocacy. Just as special is 4,000 determined people blanketing this park. To me, it's, it, it's so important that everybody comes together. Uh, newly diagnosed uh, families can come out and see that there is a huge community. There's tons of resources. New to it or in this fight for decades, they're unified by purpose. KMTV has long supported the Omaha Council Bluffs Breakthrough T1D Walk, and we're proud to do it again this year. Raising money to help cure, prevent, and better treat type 1. The walk starts at 1130 Saturday morning. It's an uplifting two miles together. Register online at walk.breakthrought1d.org.